match that you guys have had against them, both really tight. You know, what were you? What was the difference in that fifth set for you guys? Uh, honestly, I felt like um, we served really tough. We kind of went back to basics. We started out serving tough in the first and second game, and we did well in the third and fourth. But I felt like the fifth was definitely a lot tougher serve because we had longer stretches of um, servers back at the at the serving line. Yeah, it was Ashley and Jenna was back there too. Yeah, so. Hannah, for that last kill, you just—it looks like you just <laughs> ripped up and murdered that ball. Was was there anything extra behind that, or um, <laughs> I guess what was ahead? It's our uh, it's our last weekend at home, and I got a bunch of support around me and my teammates, so I might as well go big and go home. <laughs> and there, I remember at least one other big one where actually you hit it, and then you she just. Rip the roof down, and and what was that like to just come back to the? Because they call the timeout right after. Just the whole bench seemed like they were going nuts for you. What's that like? Yeah, <laughs> well, that's something I've that's it's something awesome. I've never done. Yeah, it's incredible. You know, it's incredible. A play like that's never happened between us two before, so that was pretty special. So, and it seemed like you guys really were able to battle in this one. The first set didn't really go the way you want would have liked. Um, how important was it to come back in that second set and take the third one, too, to kind of rewrite the ship? I thought it was good. I mean, I felt like... I don't, I don't think any of the girls ever think, like, one set down is too many. Because uh, I feel like we battle back no matter how far we're down, no matter how many sets we're down. Um, because Highlands, the first time, we were down two sets to none at the break and then came back and won those. So... Um, they were definitely defensively trying to get Darian number 12 um, in front of Hannah. Mm -hmm. And so we had to make our calls late just because she, they were making their calls late because they were trying to get in front of her. And so it was interesting to have to do that, but I think we were more focused at the net because we had to pay attention to what was going on there. And, you know, you guys had nine blocks. You more than outblocked them, you know, double. What was so effective about the block tonight? Go after it. You just have to watch your hitter and watch their arm, and they did a really good job of that. And they're, they became a little predictable with their shots. They did the same thing every time. So it's easy to pick up on something like that. And by putting a big block in front of them, it made them have to choose a different angle or a different shot. And it wasn't as hard because it wasn't their best. So it made it easier for us to pick it up. So. I've been looking. I haven't been able to find a, a Pueblo Mesa score for you guys, but. Uh, obviously, that's kind of a big deal for you guys. Come with them tomorrow. Um, how well positioned do you guys think you are to really kind of control your own destiny to get into the RMAC tournament? We're in a great position. We have a huge set of momentum for tomorrow night, and it's a huge weekend. Everybody's here, and we've got huge momentum right now. Apparently, Mason won tonight. So, oh. yeah, and, and UCCS lost. <laughs> Apparently, that's what she literally just told me. So, my husband just came in to talk about it. I know, I got that real quick. But, um, yeah. So, that's definitely helped us. And obviously, it's going to be kind of your last match of the season. How important is it to go out on a high note? So important. It'll, to end the season with a bang, especially since we're home, it, it's so much better. And plus, um, it'll give us a better start and lead into the tournament then. So tomorrow will be and very important. A win tomorrow night puts us um, with a winning RMAC record. Mm -hmm. So that's huge for us, especially with the way we started the preseason. So um, really making a huge turnaround and battling against even the toughest teams, the, the Metros and the Mesas and the Yeah. And we even had we had a great game against Mines, you know, when we played over there. So interesting. Well, thanks you guys, I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you.